Okay, let's play a game of Blitz Chess. So two, one, two, nine, good luck. Just come back if I need to. Ooh, um, I'm just gonna take that. Here it comes down. Just drop back then and kick the knight. You know he can't drop his knight back. Um kick the knight anywhere. There is a just create a weakness, but kicks him back. Let's bring the bishop back up and try and get forward somewhere. Okay. Hmm. It's a little bit mildly annoying in it, so I'm just gonna go forward. We don't want the knight or the bishop coming in here if we can help it. Well done. If he takes, can I take here? Well, he goes back. Okay, let's try and provoke a push and just come back. Okay, so he does take. Let's come across, hit the pawn. I don't see how I get my bishop up, but maybe maybe d5 is actually a move here. Might have been a move there, not now. Hmm. I'm going to give up the bishop. Just redeploy. Okay. Bishop's not going to go any better, is it? So might as well get on a useful square. I'm going to make room and drop the bishop back. Yeah, going to be very difficult to try and create any actual clear cut chance. Let's just take and look across. Got to watch out for these ideas if you get across. Otherwise, just rook over, try and trade the rook. My knight's a bit trapped now, actually. I've just realised I've trapped my knight. But down I've got one square. Hmm. Okay, so we're threatening takes, takes, and get in. Does it actually achieve anything? Bishop up. I'm just going to play a bishop up, try and provoke a pawn push and then take. Otherwise the queen up threatens in. Okay, so now I'll take. Hit the pawn, but I'm going to try and get the knight active if I can. I'm not sure I can. I guess you just move the king actually. In. I mean, have I got a pawn up maybe? Actually, maybe I have. He's come down to hit the knight. Um, okay, let's go forward then. King down, pawn up to create a threat. Or there's an immediate knight check. Okay. So now if I play a knight up, you've got to guard your bishop, right? How do you do that? Back, blunders to check. So that's a nice tactic. If you go back, it blunders the queen. But how else do you guard the bishop? Might be just a knockout blow, that it might be. So he's got queen there. That's a very nice move. I missed that. But I can force a trade. Um, knight check, queen takes. Try, 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 try. I don't think I should actually. So check. Um, let's come in over. I'm going to try and step up if he checks. Just marginally up on the clock, but he's got to keep an eye on this 
Yeah, he's pushed forward logical. Ooh, tread, 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 tread. I'm going to have to do it. Yeah, there's not much I can do here. I'm actually lost here. I'm actually lost here because I've got that pawn gone, haven't I? Oh, no, I pushed forward at the wrong moment. That was stupid. Yeah, let's just move on. Right, let's put this one through the analyzer and see what we actually did. So there are the move tiles for both players. So let's see what it was like in engine language. It felt like we were doing okay this game, and then we've just um, messed up. But obviously we were down material, and that's made the difference in the end. We might have been worse a lot of the game, of course. It felt like we were okay, but maybe we weren't. We'll just find out now. Of course, in the end, I was trying to play the clock as well. The point was very low on time, but I didn't manage to do it well enough. Yeah, so opponents actually played the ending essentially perfectly there. A very slight blip here, but all the ending have played it perfectly. At least looking at what we're seeing here. Okay, they have planted it back level. So in this position, taking the pawn was a blunder, and it's actually back level. Yeah, I thought we were... I should have taken with the... Um, the knight rather than the queen. Queen takes and queen takes pawn. And then we've got our pawn back and we must be able to stop this pawn. We're suddenly back leveling the game. That's the crucial mistake. So it was relatively level to that point. So I thought we played it not too bad. So in this position, we are actually not point not level. Then here, I shouldn't have taken the pawn. I should have played f5 and not even worried about the checks coming in because there's obviously this mate in one threat. We took which was a blunder. <coughs> Taking back its back to level because I missed knight takes. We must be in time to deal with this. So that was a fatal blunder. And we just lost from then on. And it's just a very good conversion by our opponent on time. So the figures were 82% versus 90% accuracy and 43 versus 24 on the CPL. So very well done.